Ended up finding three heavy bags, and I saw an Xbox 360 case peeking through there, as well as an Xbox One case. So let's take them home and see if there's anything good inside. Well, it should come as no surprise that those three bags were loaded with stuff. We've got Xbox One replacement cases, 360 replacement cases, DS replacement cases, and uh, of course there's a Pokemon in there, because why not? And even some games, a loose copy of Connect Adventures, as well as a complete copy, a complete copy of Wii Fit Plus, Assassin's Creed 3, GTA 4, missing the manual, and some Disney Infinity Power Discs, or whatever you call these, and the Portal, which is uncut. These all came out of those three bags, and you know what? I am never going to tire of finding free stuff. And we've got a big bag of stuff. Let's see if there's anything good inside. Well, this was just perfect timing. I don't know if you can hear it, but it just started pouring its ass off outside. I, I just went through the box with the bag in it, and um, I brought it all inside. It's a good thing I didn't stay out there and go through it, or else this memory card might have gotten soaked, as well as this copy of Earth Defense Force 2017. These are the only two things worthwhile in those bags. But EDF 2017, I've been wanting to get this for a while, and it is complete. It's got the manual there and the disc, and the disc looks like it's in pretty good shape. I don't see any cuts or chunks missing. I've been wanting this for a while. I have EDF 4.1 for the PS4, but I've been wanting to get the other two games for the 360 because Mark from Classic Game Room raves about this series. And uh, if you've never played it, um, you should. You should at least play 4.1. It's just mindless destruction. It's wonderful. And now I finally have 2017 for the collection. Got a little memory card there that I can... Yeah, yeah it's pretty paltry, 4 gigs, but I can put some game footage on it or something anyway but still EDF 2017 fresh from the dumpster for free so even though it's raining outside I'm gonna stay nice and cozy in the house and I'm gonna play myself some EDF 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 alright guys this right here is a prime example of why I do what I do uh, I just stopped by the dumpster and I pulled this out yeah that's a PS3 now it's really dusty, but it's an otherwise good cosmetic shape. Now, I don't have a controller at home, but I do have a power cable and a video cable, so I'm going to bring this home and clean it up and test it. And if it works, this will be my first PS3. During that generation, I went with the Xbox 360, so I missed out on a lot of PS3 stuff. I, I just I can't wait to bring this home and test it. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to hop back in the car, bring it home, and have my fingers crossed. All right, guys, this is it. Moment of truth. I've got everything plugged in. Got an HDMI cable plugged in, power cable, and it's definitely getting power. So let's see if the GameStop dumpster has now provided me with my first ever PlayStation 3. All right, well, that's good. That lit up green, and you can hear it... Uh, Oh my god. Oh my god, it works. Okay, um, I, damn it, I wish I had a controller. I don't have a controller, so I can't test to see if any of the games will play, but the video obviously works. Power obviously works. It's not super loud. It's not like grinding or anything, you know, the fan. I, holy crap, are you kidding me? My first ever free PS3. I guess I'm gonna have to get some games <laughs> and uh, get a controller and test this thing out. This is unbelievable. 
thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the rest of the channel. We make new videos weekly. Also, don't forget to subscribe, follow us on Twitter, and follow us on Facebook where we do random Steam game giveaways every week.